Derek White scored a career-high 38 points. Jason Tatum added 20 and 10 rebounds, and the Boston Celtics beat the Heat 102-88 on Monday night to take a 3-1 lead in their Eastern Conference first-round series. Jalen Brown scored 17 points, and Drew Holiday had 11 for the top-seeded Celtics, who lost Kristaps Porzingis in the first half to what the team said was a right calf injury. Boston won at Miami for the sixth straight time and improved to 14-3 in their last 17 games on the Heat's home floor. Bam Adebayo finished with 25 points, 17 rebounds, and 5 assists for Miami, which had a cello crowd, including Lionel Messi, but played again without injured starters Butler and Rozier. The Heat managed only 84 points in Game 3 and struggled again on offense in Game 4. Tyler Hero scored 19 points and Caleb Martin had 18 for the 8-seeded Heat. The Celtics can advance to the second round on Wednesday when they host Game 5. The Boston-Miami winner will meet the Cleveland-Orlando winner in the East semifinals. That Cavaliers Magic series won't end until at least Friday. But the Celtics now have an injury concern, with Porzingis lifting his jersey over his face in exasperation after getting hurt late in the first half. And with 5.04 left, the drama ramped up again when Tatum tried to shoot a three-pointer after a foul was called. Adebayo defended the dead ball play, and Tatum rolled his left ankle, but stayed in the game. After Adebayo stepped into his landing area, referees called a flagrant one on Adebayo and a technical on Al Horford. The good news for Boston, history says this series is just about over. This is the 29th time a Boston team has taken a 3-1 lead in a best-of-seven series. The Celtics won all 28 of the previous series, including seven times in the NBA Finals in a first-round series against Miami in 2010. The last games that he played before luring James and Bosch to South Florida and forming a super team around Dwayne Wade. Miami just couldn't keep up in this one. White had 16 points in the first quarter when the Celtics built a 34-24 lead, and no matter what the Heat did on defense, the offense couldn't make up any gaps. The Celtics had 34 points after 12 minutes, and it took the Heat almost 23 minutes, nearly the entire first half, to hit the 34-point mark. Miami had only 59 points through three quarters, matching a season low set in Game 1 of this series at Boston. So once again, Final score, Celtics 102, Heat 88. Spread was Boston minus 10.5. The over-under was 205.5. Who did you have? Let me know. Comment section below. Whoever it was, hope you tailed or faded and you got that cash. Good luck, gang. We'll see you in the next video. New to the channel, consider subscribing for more. This is Trending Rabbit. Agree or disagree with these picks and plays? Let me know in the comment section below. I'm always interested to hear your take. Yeah, it's the first time I'm doing this by cam. Well, one of a few times anyways. Maybe I'll do more. But anyway, the point is, let me know who you're picking in the comment section. And if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. Thanks, guys and gals. Get that cash. This is Trending Rabbit.